got, we got kids and they're winners. They just, they haven't started to win yet, but it's coming, it's coming. Growing pains have become a common word to describe the state of UConn football through a recent tough stretch. Up against another top 25 opponent today, they struggled once again. But in what seemed like a game without many takeaways, Coach Mora plans to use it as fuel. You probably sound crazy. I'm glad we played them. I'm glad we played them. I mean, when you go through what we just went through, and you don't quit, and you don't fracture as a team, you don't start pointing fingers at each other, and you build on those things, you know what I mean? Finding strength in these small successes has been a cornerstone to measuring the Huskies' progress so far. Their us-against-ourselves mentality allows them to be resilient and move forward. There's not one player on this team that doesn't still believe that this would be a successful season. I know it sounds like coach speak, but it's not. It's true. I get to watch it every day. The lessons we learned, the hardships we faced, will just prepare us for these next seven. There's no revolution without the rough patches. With likely the worst behind them, the Huskies look ahead to Fresno State at the rent next week. There's still a lot of football left to play. From Carter-Finley Stadium in Raleigh, North Carolina, I'm Julie Gintoff.